This is Code Combat. I'm currently working on Computer Science 2, the Python version. I'm on level 15, backwards standoff. Goal, wipe out the camp. If cleave is ready, use it. Else, attack the nearest enemy. Okay, that, well, makes sense. So if cleave is ready, use it. Else, attack the nearest enemy. All right, so what we need to do here, they already have this variable enemy. So we make this variable enemy, and then we say, here, I'll look around and find the closest enemy. Now what we're going to do, use an if statement, okay, if, and I'm just going to click what they have here. It doesn't want us to say if enemy, if statement with is ready, check cleave. So I need to get rid of enemy, and I need to do hero dot is ready, yes. And then what am I checking? Oh, good, it auto-filled in cleave. Oh, did I? I'm going to hit control Z to undo, I think. Oh, no, I was fine. Control shift. Z to redo, I just need to, boom. Ah. So if hero is ready, cleave. So our if statement's gonna say, if it's ready, we can run some code in here. And what it wants us to do is cleave. Okay, that sounds good. Else, okay, so else, so I did that stuff. I'm gonna get rid of their little thing here. And then now I want an else statement, else colon, Attack the nearest ogre. Okay, so else attack and if it's an ogre, I believe it's going to take two hits Now what will this code do? I'm going to get rid of this stuff because I don't need it now what this code should do Oh, I don't know what happened there what this code should do is wall true so this is going to repeat forever we first say hero look around and find the nearest enemy. My hero is going to look around. He has already named this one the enemy. Okay, so that's the nearest enemy. Then we check. We ask the computer if hero is ready. The computer, hey, here, computer, is hero, is cleave ready, right? If it is, we're saying, okay, well then use that. So if hero is ready, if cleave is ready, so if it is, it will say true. And so the computer says, okay, that is true then drops down and it's going to run this code, which is hero cleave. It then skips the else statement and goes back to the top of our wall true loop. However, if cleave isn't ready, maybe we just used it. The computer says, if hero is ready, cleave. Hero is false. That's not ready. So it skips this stuff, hits the else and says, okay, I'll run this. The other thing was false. Attack and attack. Let's give this a try. Ooh, but it's dead. That means I want to go back. So I'm gonna... Ooh, is there a pause? It's probably going to technically tell me it's correct, but if these are munchkins and not ogres, I should only hit them once. So I'm going to hit skip, and I don't care. Technically, I got it. I want it to be exact. So for munchkins, you only need to hit them once. Let's try that. Awesome. Oh, maybe they are uh, ogres. Maybe our new sword is just much stronger. So here's that code that worked for me. Great. Onward.